Hey guys, how you doing? Just thought I'd do this quick video to um, go through my thoughts on the new um, Michael Keaton Batman, which is just come out. So let's have a look. Um, yeah, I think this is absolutely unbelievable. Um, I had the original Keaton Batman DX08 and or nine, I think it was with the with the Nicholson Joker, but. Just looking at this now, um, I'm excited for the Flash movie as it is, but um, after seeing the new 89 that they released a few weeks ago, pre-order or a few months ago, um, I was impressed with that and I know I'm going to pick that up. Um, but just looking at this, I think Hot Toys have just absolutely smashed it out of the park. I mean, even this pose here looks amazing. Um, but yeah, going through it. And I mean, Hot Toys always seem to do amazing head sculpts for older sort of people. Um, just going on like Dooku and, and, and especially the Star Wars like Tarkin and things like that. Um, and old Luke, you know, uh, Hobo Luke and things like that. But uh, this looks absolutely stunning. Um, uh, there's a few people that I saw this morning looking at this saying it didn't look like Keaton, but I just think they're, in my opinion, absolutely mad. This is 100% on. Um, the rolling eyes look will give so much sort of depth to the to the head sculpt i think you could do so much he's got always always looked quite moody anyway especially as bruce wayne um i mean that one on the right is unbelievable i think they've got that spot on um i can't see why people don't think it is but it's down everyone's different and you know that's the way it is isn't it that's why we like collecting everyone thinks of things differently and likes things differently but i think this is stunning um I've heard the movie's good, so let's hope that um, they do a lot of figures from this from this movie, this IP. Um, I think they will. Uh, again, I love that we can take the cowl off and hold it like that. Um, I mean, compare this sculpt to the Batman Returns that came out quite a long time ago. That is night and day. Obviously, 30, 40 years difference or 30 years difference in uh, the actor's age and all that, but I think everything's moved on since then so much. Uh, yeah, this looks stunning. Um, again, I, I like the suit. I think it, it looks great. Um, the base is nice, nice light up base. Uh, yeah, it looks it looks fantastic. I haven't really looked through these pictures properly. I just sort of put them on here and go through them with everyone. Um, but again, that looks stunning, man. Absolutely awesome. Um, yeah, I just, I'm blown away how good this looks. Again, yeah, so good, and that's from that um, scene in the in the trailer. Uh, yeah, it looks great. Yeah, the thing is, I, the one thing I'd probably am going to critique a little bit is what the cape's going to be like because I'm not one that sort of poses in sort of big, elaborate, like sort of windy sort of poses, you know, with that sort of vibe. So it'd be interesting to see if the cape sits quite well. Um, you'd have to get customs because I know I'll probably get a custom for the new 89 that's coming out in a couple of years, 18 months rather. Um, so it'd be interesting to see how the, the cape sits. It looks wired, which is fine. Um, but are there two separate capes? Because obviously when it's all like um, in flight mode, it looks a little bit different. So it'd be interesting to see like that. I mean, that's obviously a different cape, isn't it? Um, I can imagine, I think. Um, but yeah, the proportions look great. Um, I'm just blown away how good this looks. Really good. Um, it'd be interesting to see how many people would pick this up. Um, with Batman, it's a bit weird because with my Star Wars figures, I've got a one figure per character rule. So I have to pick my favourite from each one. Where Batman, I've got the DX19 bail. Um, and I'll get the 89. So I think I'll be a little bit different with, when it comes to Batman because it's such, so many different sort of actors and genre, sort of genres is not the right word, but sort of part, you know, so many different sort of parts. It's not the same character, so to speak, if you know what I mean. It's it's, it's Batman, but they play it differently. Well, obviously, if you've got Luke Skywalker or something, it's the same character in the same world. So I don't mind that. I'm just talking myself around by more Batmans, I think, because I'll probably get the Patterson one as well, either from Inar or... Um, hot toys this looks great and i think the mouthpiece to me looked absolutely superb i think they look just old and weathered and everything the eyes look great yeah this is fantastic um <coughs> excuse me uh, great articulation good 
Um, that's good. Um, yeah, and these look great. The the left, the middle one looks a bit weird, but the the left and the right one, the right one looks great. That's that's that sort of, I think that sort of cheeky, dark smile that he's got. And especially he's in the trailer that as well. But the one on the left is is the one that looks amazing. Yeah, that uh, looks a bit weird. But I think I think yeah, I think once you see the movie, you might understand it a little bit more. I think, but um, yeah, it looks good. Overall, it looks great. Like I say about the the cape is a bit. I hope it sits a bit more. I probably will have to get a custom because I'm not a you know I'm a more of a museum poser, so that might be near on the same pose that I'm actually going to do. But hopefully, it's a, a little bit more articulated than the Val Kilmer one. Um, yeah, these look fantastic. It's great, cool. Yeah, this is awesome, man. Awesome. There's some really good pictures here as well. Articulation does look good. I love this. The first edi edition exclusive accessory. Um, I don't know what that means. Obviously, it must be the first batch or something. Um, be interesting to see who gets that. To be honest, I'm not that bothered. Um, I don't know if I would display it, so it's not a, a you know, major thing for me. And this is what it comes with. So I think, yeah, I'm just having a look now. I think it must be a different cape, two capes. Um, but like I said, I'll probably end up getting a custom one anyway. But this looks fantastic. Um, yeah, absolutely blown away with this. Uh, I keep saying that, but it's one of those that when Hot Toys drop something like this, I get excited and just want to um, get this now. That's the same with the the um, images last week with Guardian of the Galaxy. Um, I mean, at least with the Flash, it's not even out yet, but with the Guardian stuff. I mean, if Hot Toys had actually released them now, I think they would sell far many than what they would do in 18 months. But obviously, that's the chat where everyone always has about this. So, But overall, um, again, just going over it, I think this is brilliant. I might, I, it depends if I like the movie, but see how if I um, want to pick this up instead of the 89 or plus with the 89, probably would be plus with the 89. But all in all good um this is the first time i've done one of these like this so hope it's okay um please like the channel um quite new so it'd be great for anyone's support and i'll see you soon cheers bye